Whispers of the Past. Chapter 6, Seeking Answers. Kira's determination to unearth the origins of the pendant and the story of the tormented spirit within led her to the city's museum, a place where history and mystery intertwined among the ancient artifacts of Asian heritage. The museum, with its vast collection, held whispers of the past, each piece a key to understanding the complex tapestry of history and the supernatural forces that shaped it. As she wandered through the exhibits, Kira's thoughts were a whirlwind of anticipation and apprehension. Her journey had taken her from the comfort of her home into the depths of her family's ancestral legacy, each step revealing more of the enigmatic puzzle that was her inheritance. It was here, amidst the relics of a bygone era, that she hoped to find clues about the pendant's creation and the betrayal that had marked her lineage. Her quest brought her to Dr. Anaya Joshi, a historian and expert on ancient rituals and artifacts. Dr. Joshi, with a keen understanding of the spiritual significance of such items, listened intently as Kira shared her story. The tale of the dream, the spirit's plea, and the pendant's eerie glow intrigued the historian, who recognized the significance of Kira's revelations. Dr. Joshi recounted the story of a village renowned for its connection to the spirit world, a place where shamans wielded powers that bridged the earthly and the ethereal. This village, she explained, was the likely birthplace of the pendant, crafted not merely as an ornament, but as a spiritual guardian. However, the historian's voice grew somber as she delved into a darker chapter of the village's history, a time when betrayal from within had led to a great tragedy The betrayal, as Dr. Joshi detailed, involved a figure close to the shaman who had created the pendant. Motivated by greed and a thirst for power, this individual sought to harness the pendant's connection to the spirit world for personal gain. The ensuing conflict culminated in a curse that bound the spirit of the betrayed to the pendant, a guardian turned prisoner, doomed to an existence of unrest and sorrow. This revelation resonated with Kira, the pieces of the puzzle aligning with the visions from her dream. The spirit's restlessness, its plea for help, was a legacy of the betrayal that had occurred centuries ago, its repercussions echoing through time, impacting not just the village, but Kira's family as well. Empowered by this new understanding, Kira knew what she must do. The path to resolving the spirit's anguish and lifting the curse lay in returning to the source, to the village where the pendant was forged, and confronting the shadows of betrayal that lingered there. As she left the museum, the weight of her task settled upon her shoulders. The journey ahead promised challenges, both physical and spiritual, but Kira was resolute. With each step, she would draw closer to the truth to healing the wounds of the past, and to freeing the spirit that had suffered for far too long 